Hello everyone and welcome to the Digimon card game video. This time we're going to be taking a look at the special entry starter deck set, which features the cutest art of Gammon I've probably ever seen, and that says a lot because every art of Gammon is cute. So I would imagine that this starter deck is even more of a starter deck than the other decks before it, on the basis that this is probably aiming to get people who are watching Ghost Game into the card game. So let's open this up and take a look. And I feel lazy and I don't feel like opening it the way it's probably intended to, so I'm just going to grab my scissors and... Wow, I'm not sure what this plastic's made out of, but it's the strongest thing ever, jeez. Alright. There, I'll just cut there. Wow, that is surprisingly strong tape. So we'll get rid of that, and we'll remove that insert there, and there it is. Him, the boy, the baby, Gammon. I love him so much. So we get quite a nice little deck box here, which the other starter decks don't really come with. They just come with the paper packaging. This is a lot nicer. Has a little Gammon silhouette on the back with the same sort of art, but the silhouette version of it. It's got some Velcro there, and then it's got, obviously, the decks, and you can see the inside of the box is now empty, because I've taken the insides out, and that's usually how things work. And we'll move that plastic, and we've got a separator there to keep the, I guess, the cards from scratching in the inside of the plastic. And now we've got some cards to look at. So, unlike other starter decks that have cards that start with, for example, ST, or to mean starter deck, these cards are actually from boosters. So it's a deck that's made out of existing cards, except for that one. That one's from starter deck 1. So it's sort of reusing cards from the series rather than making new ones for the starter deck. That's a really cute... And I think the art... That looks like different art too, and I like how Hawkmon's hanging out with Falcomon, the original version. So at least we get also new art for these existing cards. So they're kind of like a big deck of alt art, so that's pretty cool. I wonder if we'll be getting this deck in English. And if, if we do, I don't usually pick up the English starter decks, but I would definitely pick this one up. <laughs> Just to get more of this art. I don't know, the Hawkmon is definitely now my favourite art in the all the TCG. De lots of things from the first two booster sets. At least it's, it's nice to have it, like new art on these cards. So yeah, it seems like a fairly like average deck, and there's we've got Tai Chi, which is annoying. We shouldn't have Tai Chi. We should have a uh, hero, but we don't have a Gammon card in the main body of the deck. We've got our option cards. That's really cool art as well, and of course our memory counters, and then we've got a promo of Gammon with that face that's on the the deck, and it's promo 65, which I'm trying to remember. I think that that was the one that came with that the first uh, copy of Psycho Jump that came with Digimon Dreamers, which was the November issue, I think, which came out in October. So I'm not quite sure if that's the exact same or if that's an additional promo, but in any case, still super cool to have. So it's a nice little deck to get somebody into the card game if they are only familiar with Ghost Game. However, the Digimon featured are uh, not really ones that have appeared in Ghost Game. I don't Has any of these Digimon appeared in Ghost Game yet? No, none of them. I think Ogremon's appearing in Dreamers, if you've watched my Chapter 3 translation video. But I'm not sure about Fugumon. It might actually be Fugumon. Maybe it could be Fugumon. I can't tell. It's in black and white. But yeah, none of these Digimon have actually appeared in Ghost Game yet. So I guess you would buy it expecting Ghost Game characters and only get the promo cards. But at least you get a nice box. So there is that. But yeah, it is weird that we don't get many characters that have made an appearance in the anime other than just the Ghost Game promos. But in any case, that was a super quick look of the 11th starter deck. 
And I guess it's to get more people into the card game. So that's exciting because Ghost Game is really good. And if you haven't watched Ghost Game, it's only up to episode, as of recording this, episode 10. And so far, really good. Really enjoying it. Definitely give it a watch. But let me know what you think about Ghost Game and let me know what you thought about this deck. Would you get this deck? I would. Just for the cute art of Gamamon and the deck box alone. And by I would, I mean I already got it. So, I mean, obviously, as you can tell. But in any case, thanks for watching this video and I will see you on the next one. Bye!